Final thing. Sometimes you're going to want to bunt to the first baseline. Sometimes you're going to want to bunt to the third baseline. So you're going to have to angle your bunts. The handle of the bat is like the rudder on a boat. Right? If you're driving a boat, you've got to move that rudder and it helps you steer. The handle of the bat helps you steer the baseball. Outside corner, top of the strike zone, everything out in front so I can see it all at once. And if I want to bunt down the first baseline, I just move that rudder so that now my angle is there. I still have my 45 degree, but now I'm bunting down first base. If I want to bunt down third base, I'm going to move that rudder in towards me a little bit. And again, I'm going to bunt by third, down third baseline. Okay, let's try that one more time. Outside corner, top of the strike zone, everything out in front. And I just moved my rudder, and now I'm bunting down third base. Okay? So that's what's going to direct the ball for you. Okay, we're going to do a couple with a couple of players. Um, Tyler, I want you to come in first. Coach? A, a couple of things to point out, Sue, just like the rudder, is the angle of the bat in relation to home plate will determine... So if your bat is angled on this corner of the, bat, of, the, of the home plate, that ball's going to go that way. If you angle it this way off to the home plate, it's going to go in that direction. And the other th key thing that he does is that he is totally balanced looking forward. He's not doing this. Okay? He actually comes, swings his hips, and gets into an athletic position so that I can go. And like I said, we don't want to go up, but I can be right here if I need to go down. Okay, this way, look at the angle, this way, look at that angle. I think an interesting point, guys, is, is Coach Louie brought up the back of the plate. Did you know that that back of the plate extends, and that really is intersects that foul line and meets that foul line? So anything there is a fair ball, right? So that's the angle that Coach was talking about, okay? Tyler, let's see if you can do a few, right? Get out in front. Okay, define the strike zone, get it out in front nice and early. Okay, good. Now Tyler wants to move a little bit in front so that he's out in front of the plate and that ball would have been fair. If I'm going to sacrifice bunt, okay, I'm going to square nice and early because it doesn't matter to me where the, the defense knows where I'm at, that I'm bunting. Okay, so I'm going to square to bunt when the pitcher lifts his leg. Okay, so as the pitcher goes into his windup, when he lifts his leg, that's when Tyler's going to square to bunt, okay? If I'm going to bunt for a base hit, then I can wait a little bit longer, and when the pitcher hits the ground on his pitch, then I'm going to drop that bunt down and square nice and late, okay? So right now we're working on a sacrifice bunt, so I want Tyler to square around really, really early, okay, so that he makes sure that the bat's out in front and he defines his strike zone for himself, okay? Here we go, Ty. Square. Good. Now, Tyler does a really good job catching the ball with the bat and taking a lot out of it, but sometimes when you're too fine, the ball doesn't go far enough, right? We want the ball to make sure it gets just about to the grass so that the catcher doesn't pick it up really quick, okay? Go ahead. Come on, Ty. Good. Bunch down and get it. Fair ball, fair ball, fair ball, base hit. Make sure we bend in our knees. Okay, you tried to take a little bit too much off of it. Make sure we get the bunt fair. And, right? Foul balls or strikes. Coach. And one point on that is how, why that's happening is because in the setup mode, he's right in front, but then he falls behind the plate. So just like Coach Reyes told us, so if we're bunting, where should we be in relation to home plate then? Out in front, right? So if we are dead loading the ball because we want to catch it, we're still going to be in front of that plate. The objective of the bunt, a sacrifice bunt, is to move the runners either from first to second, second to third. That is a sacrifice bunt. Let's get this one fair. Beautiful. Beautiful. Great job, kid. Now, what coaches might want to do is they might want to give them targets. And you can toss out a hula hoop or you can toss out some poly spots and you can give those your players a target. Now, I want you to try to hit that, one of those, okay? Let's try to hit the third base target. Okay. 
Hey, you gotta go a little farther, right? Don't take quite as much off. Good beautiful, job. beautiful. Great.